What marks? These... well... like burned on, with hot iron. On the palms, inside. Burned? Like a cattle brand? Aye. Though these wasn't black scars scabbed over. They's hot and glowing, as if they burned with raw fire. Thanks for your help. The lady. She'll be all right in the end, won't she? I'll do what I can to see that she is. So here our paths diverge. Thank you, Dea. Go in peace. You, I challenge you. Boots a bit big, maybe. Careful not to trip. Halt, I say. I am Ronvid of the Small Marsh, bound by a sacred oath. Oh, that's rough. My sympathies. To honor Maid Bilbury, fairest of all maids I know, by dueling a hundred knights to the death. Now, draw your sword post haste. But I have 99 left after you. Hmm. Why are you challenging me? Don't recall doing anything to offend the maid Bilberry. Well... Why... Um... Then swear. Swear! Maid Bilberry's the most loveliest of all. Thing is, I've never laid eyes on her. Ah, I shall wash your scorn away with thy blood fiend. Stand and fight. Given me no choice. Yes, luck stood with you. But but the next time we meet. Challenge me again. Raise your hand, draw your sword, look at me the wrong way, and I'll kill you. You so sure of that? Yes. We shall see. Oh! 
Ask a service of the Witcher, the Pelamost. A witcherly service, that's to say. What do you need? Tell me. A man who fears no evil the Pella needs. Forefather's Eve is nigh, with rites to conduct. Wandering souls to emerge, damned souls too. We've the circle to protect from these wretches. Seems like you could use a witcher, so yeah, I'll help. You'd not refuse, the Pella knew. The time's come to gather the folk. Across the lake we must journey, to Fike Isle. There, in the circle of stones, we shall meet. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. Assist you. Looking for someone who can craft me some armor. Gotta be top quality. Well, I've been at it 20 years now. Mastered the craft in some respects, if I do say so myself. <laughs> you wish. Don't listen to her. She's been sore lately, snorting every chance she gets. So, what kind of armor are we talking about? Light, but durable. Can't constrain movement, and I gotta be able to get in it without anybody's help. That all? Sure it shouldn't be self-cleaning. And how about it wipe your arse after you take a shite in the bushes? Sounds great. Can you make a suit like that? No, but find someone who can and I'll gladly meet them. Ought to know one thing when it comes to armor. If it's got to be durable, it can't be light. It can. Just needs the proper tools to make it. Tools like the folk of Clan Tordoroch use on Undvik. Joanna! I told you time and again to stay silent when I talk to customers. Shouldn't pester folk with those nonsense Skellige legends of yours. It ain't legend. And it ain't nonsense. My granddad would go to Undvik for his armour. Said Tordoroch folk made the best. Till last year, that is, when a giant ravaged their island. Inhabitants either ran off or died, but the forge should still be in one piece. Worth looking into. Say I find the tools. Will you craft the armor for me? <clears throat> On condition you bring the tools. But only then. Look for the tools next time I'm in Skellige. Take care now. How can I help you? Take care now. Huh. Wouldn't mind a...
so long. Greetings. Just in time. Good folk, behold the one who will protect us. You needn't fear. Soon shall we summon the wandering souls. Beyond all help, some will be. From these, you must protect us. Evil creatures keep at bay. Keep at bay till the ritual's done. Begin. Keep us from harm, and let them not disturb the circle. What is this life? Well, you know. What comes next once life subsides? Man is all fate Soon will rise thy dead, thy buried. Each will say by what they're hurried. Will ye grant these souls reprieve? Let's begin for Father's Eve.
ye who wander on the gale, ever caught in this world's world, she is I, gentle pale, ye who Souls will judge ye all. A sound I hear. Tis right. A spirit breaks the still of night. Burn the incense ever higher. Spirit, join us round the fire. Spirit, speak. This time is yours. Tell us of your ghostly woes. Who are you? He knows. Should I drive him away? Nice. No. I've come for you, Patricide. Begone, foul force! I cast upon you the light of the eternal fire! Abomination! Stop this at once! The errant souls! We must help them! Silence! I'll not tolerate necromancy! Help me! Leave now. You're disrupting the ritual. This is black magic. These folk disturb the dead. We cannot allow it. We will not. You don't know a thing about their customs. Take you and disperse the others. Leave not these grounds! Ye cannot break the circle! What? Lost the nerve? It is an ill turn. Ill. Woe are we. Blood has stained the hallowed ground. Yet we cannot stop what has begun. If you want to continue, I'm ready. Good folk, we must the eve complete. Prepare yourselves. Ye we summon, ye we call. Enter souls, we'll judge ye all. All is Something whispers, something peeps, someone near our fire creeps. All is quiet, all is all is Great! This sacred ground is with blood stained. We cannot the ritual complete. People, save yourselves. If your lives you value, run! lost. Hmm, gotta be a peasant who told the witch hunters about the ritual. That spirit they drove away. Your father's ghost, right? 
Threatened to come back. Likely to keep his word. Old man Ambros, the Pella fears not. You can't hope to manage this alone. You're afraid, that's clear. Wraith will hold sway over you. Listen, I'll send him off. I've got to. But I need to know where he's buried. Corpse probably hasn't turned to dust yet. That's his bond to the world of the living. Ambros lies in the swamp. Fine. I'll find his body, see what I can do.
Master, you'll stay clear of that fog if you value your life. Careful, sir. A monster prowls the bog. Enter the mist and you'll never see home again. I can help. For a fee. Course! Why, even an ox don't pull a plow for free. Time I got to work. Where'll I find this monster? Start south of here. But beware, bad poxy air hangs o'er the marsh. Stings your eyes, claws at your throat. Claws so hard you could choke. 